This is a really nicely constructed rally by Sarah Jane Perry. So this is where it begins. She's reaching across on the forehand and she manages to get Laura in this ugly position. That ball just clips the sidewall in the right place for SJ. It's dying, it's fading. Laura's doing that classic lunge 45 degrees into the back corner, which always means the player is slightly defensive. She has to boast it out from that dying length, has to hit up on the ball. And this is where part of the magic happens. This is classic SJ. Rack it up really early, approaches the ball, and actually gets there, gets that right foot down really early and stops everything. And from there, just look at Laura's body position. She doesn't know where to go. She's already got into that position and she's sunk down into it. And if you can get your opponent in that position there, that SJ has got Laura in, that's deadly. You know what? Within reason, any shot is going to be beneficial from there. It's all about this body shape, that early position, that early threat. She's got that racket up. It's relatively still. And she just keeps her position. She just holds it. Laura's in that sunken position. And then, you know what? She actually plays a beautiful fading length as well. Hits it toward just the back of the service box. And though, even though Laura changes direction and just about can get there, look at what happens at the end. She really just cuts it off and checks it. So the ability to, for SJ to really stop that ball as well is pretty phenomenal. So how she does it is she's going in there, opening her racket face, hitting on the inside of the ball. That's where the magic happens. She's dropping her racket head inside, knowing she's in the center of the court. So the angles are actually not that easy sometimes when you're in the center. And then look at how she does her quite interesting follow through and then flicks it up at the end. So all these little compromises you might see from the top players, and I wouldn't even say compromises, they actually add to the shot. The way she's able to cut inside, let that racket go in that position, but she then checks, really checks it and follows through in that really great place. And we'll just watch it in real time, this final shot, how she's able to fade it. Beautiful. You know, really, really difficult for her opponent to get that back, even if she'd gone the right way first and foremost.